What's up everybody? Today I am going to do the Fave 5 challenge as I was nominated by the send-in. So stick around to see what my Fave 5 are right after this. Alright everybody, we're back. So today we're going to do the Fave 5 challenge. Like I said, I was nominated by my very good friend Sin over at the send-in. And uh, yeah, so we're gonna go ahead. There's five different questions or categories. Um, some give you like, you know, two different options. If you don't have one, you could use the other. For those instances, I am going to show off two because it's hard for me to only pick five. So the five uh, different challenges for the Fave Five are favorite, favorite paint app, which is number one. Number two is favorite glow. Number three is favorite flocked or metallic. Number four is favorite six inch or 10 inch. And the last one, number five, is favorite sculpt slash mold. So that's what we have. So uh, yeah, it was hard to pick. It's always hard to pick, like to say, oh, this one pop is my favorite of this. So I picked out one for each one basically so we're gonna go through and I will show you them so the first one up is favorite paint app so for my favorite paint app I picked one that as I know I'm the only one that has it it's a one of a kind and it is one of my most cherished pops in my collection uh, and it will have to be Freddy Funko as Billy from Saw glow in the dark custom from Middle Brothers Customs. Uh, I won this in a little giveaway that was done by Poppin' Hand uh, and Pop Chick and Chris from Middle Brothers Customs. And I was so happy to uh, win. I kind of left this, the design idea up to Chris. I told him what I kind of was looking for. We narrowed it down to like two options and I said, just go with it. Whatever you do, I'm sure I'll love. And I absolutely love it. So this is my favorite paint app. I really did like the way he did the uh, swirls on the cheeks, so perfect. He even added blood splatter to the protect the window. Just to me, the mouth, everything. It's the fact that this was custom painted uh, by Chris over there. This has to be my favorite paint app because he did it better, in my opinion, than Funko did. I will uh, also add some out of box pictures of this and the glow uh, up so you guys can see as well and you'll see why this had to be my favorite paint app. Amazing job. It is awesome. And the fact that I'm the only one that has it makes it even cooler. So Billy, Freddy Funko as Billy as my number one favorite paint app. So number two is favorite glow. For favorite glow, I recently actually got this from a Spastics mystery box, and I will put a picture up of the glow beside it, but you'll see why this is my favorite glow when you see the picture. Just, I don't know, something about the glow is just amazing. And that will be number 542, Hot Topic exclusive, Limited Glow Chase, Elvira. So, super awesome pop. The glow is amazing on her. Yeah, so for my favorite glow today, I would have to say it is the Elvira Glow Chase. And I should have a picture up of the glow right now so you can compare. Yeah, it's amazing. So Elvira Glow Chase would be my favorite glow for number two. Number three is a favorite flocked or metallic. So I picked out a favorite flocked and metallic. It works too, right? So for my favorite flocked would have to be the uh, Hot Topic exclusive flocked chase. And that is Krampus. Just, I mean, this pop is awesome. I love this pop. I love the Krampus pops, the style on them. But the flocking on him is so awesome. So that would be my pick for number three, favorite flocked part. Now for the favorite metallic, 
because what kind of a uh, top anything would it be without having a uh, Pennywise from one of my uh, collections and this is the metallic Pennywise from Hot Topic exclusive it's with the boat right nope the balloon Pennywise with the balloon this pop I tried to get for a while and finally got it I was super excited to get this pop um, I almost dropped the pop it's again one of my favorite metallic pops for sure Pennywise so that was both for number three I answered both categories. The next one is favorite six inch or 10 inch. Okay, so for my favorite six inch, this honestly is, I wanna get the other three or four of them out there, but it would be the six inch Stay Puff, the original Stay Puff they did. And I want the Toasted one, the Glow one, and then there's the Pink Fugitive, and then the Pink Glow Fugitive, which that one is the most expensive one, so goals to get all five so the other four i guess it is of this pop so for number four favorite six inch or ten inch for my six inch i chose stay puff again you only have to pick one or the other i chose to do both so the people i nominate you do not actually probably have to do both unless you want to so say your six inch is going to be stay puff marshmallow man for number ten uh, for the 10 inch, I actually changed it. Uh, originally, I was going to use the 10 inch Stay Puff because I have both the regular and the toasted one. But I went out today, happened to pick this up while I was out because a pre order came in and this thing's amazing. So it has to be for today my favorite 10 inch. And we have the child. I mean, this box is humongous. I don't know if it's even in frame because I can't see anything. But the 10 inch child is awesome. This box literally is like two 10 inches side by side. It's basically the size of this thing. So 10 inch child is definitely uh, sitting at my favorite 10 inch right now. So he won't fit back here to show off. I mean, I might put something on this side. Huh. I don't know if you guess. Oh, you see him so. So. The last one, number five, favorite sculpt or mold. I picked three from two different styles of why I like it. But this is definitely one of my favorite sculpts or molds and a major grail for me. But I just like the detail they did to the face and the head of him. Um, and it would be Unmasked Jason. So it's just that head sculpt. I, I really enjoy it. I think it's you know a little bit different than your traditional Funko Pop. So, to me, it is one of my favorite sculpts or molds. Mr. Jason Voorhees Unmasked. And for the last one, this one I recently actually got as well. It is a pretty cool pop. The details that they put into it, it's not traditional pop style. It is the three pack dragons from Game of Thrones. I mean, honestly, how could this not end up being like someone's favorite sculptor mold? You got the half eggs down there, and you got the wings, and it is awesome. You know, it's not the traditional Funko Pop big head style that you're used to seeing. And I think they just did a very good job with how they uh, sculpt these. So, I'm sure this will be others. I um, actually believe this might have been one of Sins as well. But, I had to show off this as one of my favorite sculpts or molds. So, very awesome. Very awesome. So, this was really fun to kind of think about, you know, a little bit different. Like, favorite paint app and actual glow, flock, metallic, 6 inch, 10 inch, and sculpt, mold, like, it's not always the normal question, so it was really fun to definitely do this, so, again, thank you to Sin for nominating me as, uh, one of your two to challenge, today, I am going to nominate two, I decided I'm going to nominate Yoj Collects, so, Yoj, please make a video of your top five, I will put the questions down below in the description so everyone can see as well. And the second person I want to add, well, it's actually two people. It is 
Property Outlaws, they both just, uh, both her brothers just recently started a channel. Really awesome. So I challenge you two to do your top fave five of these questions. So uh, again, I will put the questions down below in the description so everyone can see. And uh, yeah, I'm interested to see what YoJ and Property Outlaws comes up with. I'm really intrigued. This was a really fun uh, challenge to do. So that's everything I have for you guys today. If you liked this video, please hit that thumbs up. If you're new, hit that subscribe button. And if you want to see more, ring that bell notification so it can let you know. And uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you liked my uh, top five, which ended up, of course, being more than five. Um, yeah, let me know in the comments down below. But that's everything. So until next time, I'll catch you later.